Hi everyone and welcome back to this week's episode of The Swimming Teacher. In this video, I'm going to be taking you through a typical baby swimming lesson where I teach my 18 month old son how to kick. This is from a complete beginner's point of view, where I take you through the three main steps that are needed in order to successfully teach your baby how to swim. If your baby has never been in the water before, this would be a great video to watch prior to taking them into the swimming pool and seeing how you can get them to kick their legs. Kicking is of course one of the most important fundamentals in baby swimming. My little guy, he absolutely loves the water and getting him to kick was pretty easy. And I think if you follow this video step by step, you too will be able to get your little one to enjoy the water and be able to kick. Step number one, sit your baby on the side of the pool at the steps and show them what it's like to kick their legs. Demonstrate this yourself before holding their legs at their knees, keeping their legs straight, toes pointing down and teaching them how to kick their legs in the water. It is more efficient to be able to kick with your toes down, so always remember to remind your child as soon as they flick their toes up that they need to keep them down and kick in the water. You want to try and encourage them to make as much splash as possible at this stage, just so that they can visually see what it's like to kick. You can sit them on your knees before putting them back on the wall and asking them to kick on their own. Next stage is to sit your baby on the wall and repeat the phrase kick, 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 hoping that they will in turn start to move their legs. Repeat these exercises a few times before moving on to the next part of the lesson where you're going to get your little one to kick whilst traveling. You want to get them to lie on their tummies with their chins as low to the water as possible and you want to hold them underneath their arms, propping up their torsos with your fingers. Again, repeat the phrase kick, kick, kick and look for a little bit of movement on their feet. You again want to try and encourage your baby to make as much splash as possible just to make it a little bit more fun for them. So once your baby has mastered these steps, they should know how to kick. You'll have to practice this a few times on a few journeys to the swimming pool, but eventually saying the phrase kick, kick, kick should hopefully result in an up and down movement of their legs. Thanks everybody for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye.